Hi, I'm Karen Lee, a certified financial planner and owner of Karen Lee & Associates, and I'm a registered representative with LPL Financial. Today we want to talk about transferring annuities from one insurance company to another. As we recall, annuities are financial vehicles that allow us to put money away and have them grow tax deferred. In addition, we can create a lifetime stream of income for ourselves. But during the time that we're accumulating money in this tax deferred container, sometimes we choose to transfer it from one company to another. Maybe we're doing it because the interest rates with another company are better. Perhaps we're worried about the insurance company that we're currently with and want to move to a better rated company. Whatever your reasoning, it's very important that you do this transfer appropriately. The IRS has set out code 1035 to explain how to move an annuity from one company to another. It's so important that you follow this code because this is the way you ensure that on those tax deferred earnings, you won't incur a tax penalty immediately. As long as you follow code 1035 exchange, that annuity will retain its, its preferred tax status. If you're not 59 and a half yet, there'll be no 10% penalty and you can adequately move from one company to another. Now these insurance companies have forms that you will need to use that comply with the IRS code 1035. What's real important that you look out for is that all annuities, most annuities, have contingent deferred sales charges. We call them surrender charges. And those do not go away if you choose to move from one insurance company to another. So make sure you check if there are existing contingent deferred sales charge on your current annuity, and then make sure you follow IRS code 1035 so that you can retain your preferential tax treatment and not have any early withdrawal penalty. I hope that answers your questions on how to transfer an annuity from one company to another. My name is Karen Lee. I'm a certified financial planner, the owner of Karen Lee & Associates, and a registered representative with LPL Financial.